What is the anatomical snuff box? The anatomical snuff box is a triangular depression located on the back of the hand at the base of the thumb. This area receives the name snuff box because people once used this part of the back of the hand to hold and sniff powdered tobacco or snuff. It is defined by the tendons of the extensor pollicis longus, the abductor pollicis longus, and the extensor pollicis brevis. The clinical significance of this area lies in its usefulness for identifying these structures for medical examination after hand or wrist injuries. Laterally, you can see the tendon of the abductor pollicis longus, and it is inserted into the base of the first metacarpal. The abductor pollicis longus originates from the radius and the ulna. The second tendon is the extensor pollicis brevis, which is inserted into the base of the proximal phalanx. And the extensor pollicis brevis originates from the radius. The abductor pollicis longus and the extensor pollicis brevis both form the lateral border of the anatomical snuff box. The extensor pollicis longus forms the medial border of the anatomical snuff box. The extensor pollicis longus comes from the ulna and it inserts into the base of the distal phalanx. The contents of the anatomical snuff box include the radial artery, the superficial branch of the radial nerve, and the cephalic vein. The floor of the anatomical snuff box is formed by the scaphoid bone and the trapezium bone.